McIntyre said that Dak Prescott has had a better career than Cam Newton. What the hell has McIntyre been watching over the last 10 years? Because Cam Newton had a better career than Dak Prescott had. Now, when you look at their numbers, right, let's look at their numbers in their career. Cam Newton, his career record as a quarterback is 75-68-1. Dak Prescott's record is 71-39. and But let's remember, Dak Prescott is playing for a better organization than what Cam played with in Carolina. The Cowboys organization is a better organization than the Panthers organization. So that matters, and that is a factor when you compare – quarterbacks and their accomplishments and accolades let's go to completion percentage cam completed 60 percent of his passes in his career Dak prescott has completed 67 percent of his passes so i'll give Dak the edge in completion percentage now Dak prescott he averages 259 passing yards per game cam averaged 219 passing yards per game i would say that Dak prescott was a better pocket passer than Cam Newton, but he was never the athlete that Cam Newton was in his prime. Do y'all understand what Cam Newton was doing in Carolina? The year when the Panthers went to the Super Bowl, the year when the Panthers were 15-1, and one, do y'all know who Cam Newton's best receiver and number one option on that Panthers football team was? Do y'all know who it was? Ted Ginn. Ted Ginn, that was the best receiver on that Carolina Panthers team that went 15-1 and one and got to the Super Bowl. Dak Prescott has had the luxury of playing with the likes of Des Bryant, CeeDee Lamb, but yet McIntyre says that Prescott has had a better career than Cam Newton. Makes no sense. It makes no sense. Also, not only has Dak Prescott had more weapons than Cam Newton ever had. Now, Cam Newton, now real quick, too, I'm going to say this. Cam Newton did play with Steve Smith. Steve Smith played in the NFL for 16 years. When Cam Newton came into the NFL in 2011, Steve Smith was entering his 11th season in the NFL. So Steve Smith wasn't in his prime anymore. He was still a good receiver, but he wasn't great anymore. And that was the best receiver Cam has ever played with. Steve Smith, and he was out of his prime. Again, that played with Des Bryant and CeeDee Lamb. Both receivers who are number one receivers. So, also, has Dak Prescott ever won an NFL MVP? Now, he might win MVP this year, but even if he won MVP this year, he's never had the career that Cam Newton had. Considering that Prescott has never, never even reached an NFC championship game. In one season, Cam Newton did more than what Dak Prescott has ever done throughout his career. Talk to me when Dak Prescott first wins the NFL MVP and second reaches not the Super Bowl, but at least an NFC championship. And then we could talk about whether or not his career is comparable to a Cam Newton. But I have to address that. Cam had a better career than Dak Prescott. Now, let me get to these game managers that Cam Newton was talking about. Brock Purdy, Tua Tagovailoa, Jared Goff, and Dak Prescott. I agree with Cam Newton on 75% of what he said about these four being game managers. Because this year, aside, I would say Dak Prescott's been way more than a game manager. This year, Dak Prescott is balling. He really, really is. So far this year, Dak Prescott, 28 touchdowns, six interceptions, over 3,500 passing yards. Dak Prescott arguably is having the best season of his career. He's playing some great football this year, for sure. So I don't think Dak Prescott has been a game manager this season. 